Tag is a 30 mile network of a multi purpose trail designed to connect communities to open space. And the setting varies all the way around. Sometimes you're right in there with an existing, well developed, well used landscape. Sometimes you're miles out in the middle of nowhere in places that are beautiful, kind of undiscovered, um, and that, that we're going to be kind of like the first ones to really show that to the, to the world. Looking out of the landscape, you mostly see trees, but there's a whole network of mountain biking trails. So that same freshman, after a couple of months, they're looking for an adventure or pastime or a little bit of recreation um, between classes. Maybe they have a break. Again, they can just fall onto the path, come out to Eighth and Giggling, stay on Four Tag, or jump off of Four Tag to this network of really amazing uh, mountain biking trails. We want people to be able to move on foot or on bike under their own propulsion through this landscape in a way that enjoys the landscape, that celebrates it, that interprets it, and gets you to, to where you want to go. So Fortag has been working hand in hand with the planners at CSUMB to make sure that Fortag incorporates with the campus plans. And one of the most recent developments to advance the campus planning is building the roundabout on the east side of the campus. As we worked with them and looked at the engineering drawings, we talked about slopes and routes and how Fortag would intersect with the roundabout. And what you see over my left shoulder is the actual beginning of the trail that will be the Fort Ord Regional Trail and Greenway. So the university made sure that the trail at least got started to be built up the hill. So it's kind of exciting to have the beginning of the trail having already been built here on these campus. So this is a place that we've, uh, we've called Sand Mat Hill. Um, but what's really cool up on this hill is it's got one of the best inland populations of sand gilia, which is this little fella here. This is a federally endangered plant. Uh, at the state level it's threatened. It's a place where we, the, the idea of Fortag gets you know, the most strongly expressed, connecting people to nature and to open space so that you can recreate here, you can be here, you can have a trail here, but, and you can see nature, but critically, you, can, you don't want to be impacting that nature. So it's a, it's a place where we really want to rise to the challenge of having a trail without, uh, that allows us to enjoy this species without impacting it. So we're in that area between the city of Marina and the campus and uh, you know, the San Gili is one of the rare offerings that's set in this area that uh, we think Fortag will open up for folks where now they might not be inclined to wander into the, um, the chaparral to discover these things. When you're working on the, the reuse of an army base sometimes you've got to have a lot of imagination to, to see you know, what this really can be uh, and you can't you can't not have that imagination because if you don't, either nothing will happen and we'll be left with a giant parking lot forever, um, or something will happen that won't quite be, you know, what you might have wanted. Um, so you have to recognise this landscape is guaranteed to change a lot in the next, in the coming years, and we want to engage with that and make it you know, work for everybody. If it's the right time of evening, you can come up on Hilltop Park have the entire horizon and a view of the peninsula as the sun sets. So we have a really unique resource here and again it's one of those spots that uh, not a lot of people know is here. We tend to move along the roads to the commercial centers but Fortag will bring you to the beach, from the beach to the population centers, from the population centers just a short walk up the hill pop, top park to see the sunset and if you're a student then, you just continue your stroll to the promontory.